All right, good morning, guys. Uh, we plan to go to Diamond Head today, but it doesn't look too nice out. That's a lie, it looks really nice out, but <laughs> I don't know if you can really see it. There's, it's raining sideways and over at Diamond Head, there's a bunch of clouds over it. So I think we might save that for another day. But I think the plan is to just go chill out at the beach for a bit, kind of just stay in water since we're already gonna be wet, so that shall be okay. And then probably just grab food like we usually do. We haven't done any of our really tourism slash like outdoor activities yet. I think we're all saving that for the second half of our trip. So right now we will just head out to the pool and chill out. Right, Ash? Right. We decided that the beach was gonna be a better place to be at. I still don't know where the rain is coming from. Yeah, honestly, there's blue sky all above us, but it's still raining, so the wind's probably picking it up from somewhere. But guys, it is another beautiful day in paradise. All right, guys, so after all, we're gonna head to Diamond Head. The clouds above Diamond Head don't look too dark right now, so I think that should be okay. The weather should hold up. But we're trying to catch the public bus right now, and it doesn't seem like it's coming. So we're not sure if there's some sort of parade or something blocking off the street where traffic's coming onto, but we're kind of stuck here. We're gonna take the bikes, but every time we rent out those Bicky bikes, there's like a $50 deposit on each one, and they don't return it to you for like around five days, which is kind of ridiculous. So we don't want to keep having to do that and then not get our money back until basically after the trip. So I think for now, we're just gonna try and catch this uh, bus, but hopefully it comes. Not quite sure. Well, we did it. We figured it out. The bus actually took us right to where we needed to be. The weather is all blue sky up above Diamond Head. So first we're gonna hit up the Cove Health Bar to get some acai bowls. All right, so we gotta start with breakfast first before we do the Diamond Head. And we got a acai bowl and it looks like, what is in there actually? Acai, this is honey. She put a lot of honey. Bananas and granola. Nice. I got myself a North Shore blend smoothie with papaya, pineapple, coconut, and soy. We made it to the top. I'm dying for what that actually was. <laughs> but guys, check out this view. That view though. So along there is just the Waikiki Strip down below where we came from. I still can't breathe, but guys, it is magical. All right guys, we just finished Diamond Head. Uh, we came down because it had a little bit of uh, rain and it was pretty windy up there, but we're at the base right now and we grabbed some pineapple whip and we added some extra pineapples on the top. Ash already started going to town on it, so guys, we are pretty hungry and it's pretty windy. So we're gonna head back to the strip. We're gonna go grab some food and we'll figure out the rest of our day from there. Okay, so after a long walk back from Diamond Head all the way down here, we ended up at Teddy's Burgers. Got ourselves some garlic fries Ash got a single burger, and I got a double burger that has Kahlua barbecue sauce all over it. So, I don't know, I've been here once before and it was really good, so hopefully this time it's just as good. Ash, thoughts? Pretty good. Once again, like, I'm still not hot. Really? Okay, we just got back to our hotel after the Diamond Head, and we... <laughs> And we went to Teddy's to get that burger. Honestly, Teddy's was like a very underwhelming experience. 
Yeah, the burger wasn't that good. The fries were very, very greasy. And when you lifted the fries, there was like a pool of oil at the bottom. But honestly, it filled my belly, so yeah. did the job. But now we're back at the hotel and we went to the adults only pool again. And guys, I don't understand why this place has five pools, but only one hot tub that fits like four people in it. It's so small. <laughs> and so every time we come here, it's being there's packed. Like eight people in it yeah, right there's now. eight people. <laughs> it's like a whole family inside there right now. And we're just gonna chill, sit here until they clear out and then hopefully get in. But then we're gonna have the udon place tonight for some dinner. It's gonna be super delicious and it's gonna be another walk. Oh. Alright guys, we're gonna go to dinner now. Um, what is the place called? Udon? I mean, we're going for Udon. So <laughs> what? <laughs> the place isn't called Udon. No, it's not. What's it called? Marukake or something? Yeah, we're going to this place that actually makes their own Udon noodles and there was a long wait both days we were there, just like that ramen place, but... Tonight is the night we adventure. So we're gonna go for about a 15 minute walk onto, we're just near the strip and we're gonna wait in line, get some udon and probably get some shaved ice after to redeem ourselves after the first, uh, first night there. Second night, I don't remember what night we're on anymore. Basically, I just got a cold noodle, so yeah, it's not cold. hot. The broth is uh, cold, so I'm gonna stir it around, and it's got some beef, some green onions, some tempura flakes, and I don't actually know what the broth is, but I assume it's some soy sauce based one. Delicious. Let's dig in. Okay, anyways, so after dinner, we decided to walk around, just kind of settle our stomachs, um, and then we decided to come to Ice, Mon Ice Monster. Ice Monster, because the last time we had shaved ice wasn't the best for your choice. That was my fault. So friends turn. We got mango sensation. Except it came in a to-go container and we kinda wanted the for sheer container so it looked more aesthetically pleasing if you know what I mean. Anyways it'll probably still taste good. So let's dig in. All right guys, we just finished our dinner and dessert. So we're just heading back to the hotel right now because there is not much left in the day. We're just gonna chill out, plan tomorrow's trip because we do have the car, which means that we're gonna head up to the North Shore. So I'm gonna end today's vlog here. Guys, thank you for watching and thank you for joining. Thank you bus for making the sound. But anyways guys, peace. See you tomorrow, peace.